All right, we're here again to do another unboxing, and today we're going to be unboxing the Kirkland Signature Five Plaid Class. Well, this is a really long name. Five Plaid Class Stainless Steel Cookware, and a bunch of other words from a different language. Anyway, it comes with what appears to be six different pots. So you got the skillet, another skillet, a covered deep saute pan, covered saucepan, covered saucepan number two. Looks like it's a bit bigger and a covered stock pot. Ugh. So as you can see, um, we got this from Costco. Here's the edges, as you can see, they've got uh, nice little pictures of it. Looks like there's a bronze uh, bezel going around the side there. Front, back looks about the same. The sides talk about its different layers. Looks like it's got the multi different types of layers and explaining what it is. Stainless steel, aluminum, ignore this. <laughs> Um, so different other uh, parts to it. So why don't we just go ahead and get right to it. I got my trusty knife here, unboxing knife. Whoops, here we go. It's one, it's two. As we open it, looks like it's a very secure box. This appears to be one of the covers. So let's slide this open. Oh, hey, it is one of the covers. <laughs> standard, uh, looks like standard pot lid. You've got your nice handle there, actually very good. Bit hefty, good weight. Probably won't break, so it's okay. We've got some paperwork here. Um, it says care and use with an explanation of what to use, caution, care, utilization, all that stuff. So we'll probably read that later. Not. <laughs> uh, we've got another pot lid here. Same as the other one. Fairly good. Solid steel. Very strong. Got some weight to it. So you can hear that. <laughs> We've got the smaller pot lid. So I'm just gonna keep tossing these cardboards out of the way. Very nice. Again, solid, good handle. I think I can pick that up without actually getting burnt too much. So that's not bad. Here is one of the saucepans that we saw in the front. And it, wow, this is heavy. I'm not gonna lie, look at that. Um, but it does have uh, writing in the interior where you can see how many liters and quarts and whatnot. So that's actually really useful. Um, that's an indent. So for you guys wanna see, that's actually a little indent of design. So I guess it's there so you could see the multiple layers inside the, uh, inside the pot. So that's interesting. But again, very heavy. So, which kind of makes me scared of the other pots because it looks like it's going to be fairly heavy there too. Down here's the lid. Oh, and uh, yeah, so this is what it looks like with the lid on. I'm not going to lie. This is really heavy. Um, doesn't say how much weight it is, but uh, I might get a weighing scale and check that out later. Um... So why don't I just get this while you look, uh, get my assistant to get me a weighing scale here for a second. All right, let's open up the rest. So what I really like about these pots is that they all have measuring, measuring cup locations there. Look at that, that's very nice. Oh my goodness, this is heavy. What's interesting about this one is it goes up to six liters, so you can fill up the water without actually using the uh, water, um, a cup, like a measuring cup. So I'm gonna grab that. Again, same basic design. You've got the bezel here, um, stainless steel, very heavy. So we'll take a look at that later. Um, So let's take a look at the other saucepan here. We're actually almost done with the first layer. 
again another gem. So what I like about these is that they do feel extremely sturdy, unbelievably sturdy. But another useful tool, you got the measuring right there. This is a two quart, or yeah, two liter, two quart. Again, same same basic design as the other. That's very cool. I'm liking it. More stuffing here. Cardboard stuffing galore. Ah, the skillets. These are what I've been looking forward to. The skillets is unbelievably heavy again, but that is a very long handle comparatively. The cooking surface looks great, smooth. Very solid in the design. Still same with that copper inlay. Again, this is a very long handle, which keeps you away from the fire. So I like that. It's bolted in tight. It's not very, doesn't look like it's going to come loose anytime soon. So that's very nice. I like that. Let's take a look at the other skillet. Oh, massive. Oh my. This. This one feels like this could be the workhorse right here. Again, again, you've got the measuring uh, measuring spoons there or measuring, uh, uh, I don't know what to call that. <laughs> the measuring lines, there you go. We've got measuring lines there with the long handle once again, good cooking service, very nice. It's got two handles for the, the heft of it all. <laughs> So I like this, very strong, very sturdy once again. So we'll put that down. I think that may be, oh, we got one more. What a surprise. <laughs> it's the box that keeps on giving. And here we go. This is the last amazingly large cooking skillet. That is fantastic. And just for a size comparison, I am gonna get an eight and a half inch diameter paper plate <laughs> so, so that's a that's a pretty much big dynamic between what you what you're gonna get here um so eight and a half inch diameter plate i believe this is a yeah this is this is how it fits <laughs> got quite half again long handle bolted on pretty tight so it's very good so now that we've i think discovered everything part of the set piece this all together for you first and foremost we have a little weighing scale over here I'm gonna I'm gonna weigh it down to a zero so let's see food scale here okay it is set to zero right here I'm gonna pick the lightest saucepan here and we're gonna go ahead and drop it Wow, that is, let's set that back up again. And I'm gonna set it back to zero. Bam, that is almost three pounds of uh, pot there. That's a three pound mark. So just a little shy over three pounds. So that is a hefty, hefty saucepan. But uh, for the most part, that is a very, I like it. It seems very durable, very strong. And so all together, this is what the set looks like in comparison. Again, very long handles on the skillets to keep them separated. The pot is very large indeed. And for comparison, again, we go back to our eight and a half inch uh, Dixie, I think. Yeah, Dixie paper plate. So you get the size comparison of each one. This is a perfect size for Dixie cup. This one's a little shy. This one's a bit over. That is a bit over and that is extremely over. So again, this is a good size for it. Oh, I'm fine. So there it is. This is the Kirkland <laughs> five ply clad stainless steel cookware and you can feel the weight of all five clads but very sturdy very strong um we'll cook uh, we'll try to cook some stuff on these um if you want to see how they hold up after a couple of uh 
months of Filipino cooking, like and subscribe and click that alert button if you want to hear us get some more and make comments as to what you think we should cook in these pots um, and for you to see what they are. So again, thank you. Have a great day. Bye.